Hello, my name is Cam. Welcome to No Fluff Salesforce, where we get to the point with Salesforce. In this video, we're going to go over the six steps to listing your app on the App Exchange. I know you guys are dying to get into developing your product, but we just want to make sure we know where the destination is and we know the steps to get there. So let's get started. Step number one, set up and sign up. Now sign up comes first. First, you need to sign up for the partner portal. When you sign up for the, the partner community on Salesforce, they give you a special org. It's an enterprise org called your partner business org. It will be linked to your listing. It's a very important org. So again, you sign up for the partner portal and you get an enterprise org, your partner business org. And with that org, you have a special you have a few special applications. One of them is called the Environment Hub, and you're gonna be using the Environment Hub to set up all sorts of orgs, test orgs, dev orgs, and we're gonna go through that in a future video. The second step is to build your application. In this video series, we may not cover content specific to building your application, but we're gonna go through a few examples of applications. I'm gonna, I have ideas, and I'm gonna build them with you and you'll get to see how that's done. We're not gonna go over all the ins and outs of Salesforce in this video, but hopefully I'll release other content in the future that can help you build your application. Step three, package and test. This is after you're done building, you'll want to package or bundle all your, your components that you've made for Salesforce and um, sort of release those. And we'll go way deep into that process. And of course you'll wanna test. Uh, if you've coded, you want to write unit tests. If you if you haven't coded, if you've just built anything, you'll want to test it. You'll want to make sure it works. Step four, create a listing. And step five, security review. Now I'm saying both of these at the same time because you kind of need to do them simultaneously. And really the, the bottleneck is where you're going to get caught up is on the security review. That is a very long process, and I'll have a video just about that so you can hear about the security review. But you'll want to submit for the security review as soon as you can and worry about your listing later. Okay, with that being said, step four is to create a listing. And we're going to go over the visible parts of your listing, meaning the, the images, the media, the, the text, and the things that aren't visible on the back end, like setting up pricing, um, setting up trials, collecting leads, things like that. Step five, security review. Um, honestly, the step is one of the hardest. I think there's a lot of pressure around the security review to pass it the first time, but I'm gonna let you know that it's very manageable to pass the security review. and not run into a lot of big issues if you're careful. So in this course, we're gonna talk about, you know, what is it like to submit for security review? Should you be scared of the security review process? How long does it take? All those questions will be answered. And finally, step six is publishing and beyond. And I seriously mean beyond. A lot of, you, the goal kind of is publishing, but like there's so much to do after publishing. So we're going to talk about you know publishing how do you support your clients how do you market your app where can you market your app um, how do you how do you upgrade clients how do you give them licenses how do you upgrade your listing and if you want to know more you let me know because i'm willing to adapt my course you tell me what you want to know and i'll figure it out if i don't know and i'll let you know how to do it thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe